I'm making a Philly cheesesteak pizza tonight. Now, here's my pizza crust, and, and it is small, but it's only a third of the mix. So what I did is I, I took a pizza crust and I split it into three mixes. That way I, um, you know, could make more than myself and we could have personal pan pizzas. Kind of fun, kind of fun for a change. So very first thing I want to do, I've prepared all my ingredients, but I want to put my tomato sauce on. And uh, you can put, I use, I like this uh, organic bill. There's a lot of different uh, brands, you know, that you can use. This one, you know, we like. And you can also make your own pizza crust, I mean, pizza sauce, I mean, without it being too much trouble. So I like my sauce fairly light, so I'm not gonna go too heavy on here. Okay, so I've got my, got my pizza sauce on. Now the next thing I wanna do is I wanna put some mozzarella cheese on top of it. So I'm gonna sprinkle that around. Okay, a little bit. I'm not gonna do too much cheese because I'm actually gonna add provolone on the top. So, Philly cheesesteak, I'm gonna go ahead and put, uh, put my steak on here. So I got mine all cut up. I probably have a little bit too much, but I like it meaty, so I'm gonna put that on there and spread it out. Uh, however much or little you want, uh, this works fine. And so I just wanna get it off the edges there. Now I'm gonna sprinkle my onions. And again, I, I, you could chop them, I guess, make them a little bit smaller. I like them the size I have them. Hence, I made them the size I have them. So a little bit of onions on there. I'm gonna do bell peppers. I don't have any mushrooms on hand, so I'm not putting mushrooms on, but you could easily put them on. Now, just before I get to the last part, I wanna tell you, you could. There's variations for this. So, I'm gonna put my cheese on top here, and I just split one piece of provolone for the top into four pieces. So uh, I think that'll bake up quite nice. But here's what I wanna tell you. You can saute all your meats and your, your veggies ahead of time, or you can just bake them the way they are. It depends on how cooked you want your Philly cheese steak um, ingredients. <laughs>